I want to talk to you about, you know, getting into this game, and we've talked about defense before and, you know, what you felt like you were able to do today despite the loss. Um, I mean, we never really had control of the game or had any flow of the game, so it was hard for us to really get into it. And, uh, I mean, that was really the, the tough part today. As far as guard play, you know, the guards struggle to score. Michael Carter-Williams had some good points, but, you know, when your guards struggle, obviously that's where you t the team seems to lose. And just go into that and, you know, offensively, what happened today? I mean, offensively, I mean, no one really had a guard. I mean, Mike picked up the track a lot. But, I mean, offensively, we know what he could do. And he didn't really have everything to that. And, uh, I mean, you got to give credit to the first time. I mean, they play great defense. They're a great defensive team. And we talked about defense before and playing against zones, and you saw some man from them, but you've seen zones lately. How prepared is this team moving forward in these, you know, games that are going to be low-scoring, 50, 60-point games? I mean, we've gotten a lot better. I mean, we know that our defense is going to keep us in games, but I mean, to win games, we've got to make shots, and uh, we haven't done that. So, um, once we do that, you know, we'll when you're you know when you're in a place like this and you're away from home you know you're going to be away from home for the rest of it no matter what happens how confident is this team moving forward going into the Big East tournament I mean we're as confident as we, we can be I mean uh, I mean when you struggle it sets you back a little bit but I mean we got guys on, on this team who can really score and who can really get after it so I mean we're not really worried about that it's just because we, we've done it before and we've come out and we've scored a lot of goals and uh, we know that we can do it we just got to put together and move on. You take a loss and it stings going up against a team like Georgetown. Do these losses hurt more than anything else because of who they are? No, no. I mean, we're going to beat Georgetown twice in the season. We beat them on the home court against them. And, uh, I mean, uh, it's, it, it definitely hurts a lot more than anything else. Does seeding matter to you at all, you know, knowing now that you could end up staying in that sixth seed and not obviously not having a double bye now and not having a break in the first and second round? I mean, uh, I mean, like we did last year, having the two byes definitely helps. I mean, it's, it's two games you don't have to play. And so, I mean, now we're just going to get one bye. But, I mean, everyone in the Big East is good. So you're going to have to beat, you have to beat them to, if you want to advance. So, it's time to win that. And uh, we do get that sixth seed, we're going to be ready. And just talk to me where you're at right now as far as what you've learned from the beginning to now in your first year on the, uh, on the sure court. I'm definitely going to my game and uh, about Tyant and then uh, Behan's all kinds of defense. So I mean, I just got to keep putting them together and I just keep going for it.